hearts and serve you always with willing minds. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. So now we're going to sing the first of our hymns, which is in your order of service. Guide me, O thou great redeemer. Knows of any reason why these persons may not lawfully marry? To declare it now. Gavin and Warren, the vows that you are about to take are to be made in the presence of God, who is judge of all and knows all the secrets of our hearts. Therefore, if either of you knows any reason why you may not lawfully marry, you must declare it now. Gavin Lee Greaves, will you take Lauren Wilkinson to be your wife? Will you love her, comfort her, honour and protect her, and forsaking all others, be faithful to her as long as you both shall live? And Lauren Wilkinson, will you take Gavin Lee Greaves to be your husband? Will you love him, comfort him, honour and protect him? and forsaking all others, be faithful to him as long as you both shall live. And will you, the family and friends of Lauren and Gavin, support and uphold them in their marriage now and in the years to come? We are there. <laughs> and so let us pray. God our Father, from the beginning you have blessed creation with abundant life. Pour out your blessing upon Lauren and Gavin, that they may be joined in mutual love and companionship, in holiness and compassion.
made their marriage vows to each other. They have declared their marriage by the joining of hands and the giving and receiving of rings. I therefore claim, therefore proclaim that they are now husband and wife. And let those who God has joined together, let no one ever divide. Amen. You can kiss your brother. <laughs> Keep your belief in your 
yourself and walk into the new journey, you will find it magnificent, spectacular, and beyond your wildest imaginings. And that's my prayer for you, that it will be magnificent and spectacular and beyond your wildest dreams. Marriage is a lifelong journey of learning love together. And Lauren and Gabby, you have decided today to support and seal your love in Christian marriage. It takes courage, but you're doing that in the presence of God and in the presence of, the, of your family and friends. May your relationship continue growing throughout your lives. And to your yes to one another, you affirm that God adds his yes, his blessing. He promises life and love in the years ahead. As together you acknowledge your need and see the and the assurance that come from only him and from each other. Through your family and friends and through the life of the church. If you will have love with God to terminate your marriage and hold your love for each other close to your heart. Thank you. 
Now, it pains me to say this to the point where I've got to compliment the bridesmaid <laughs> on how beautiful she looks. Maya. <laughs>
Well, that seemed all right. So I thought I'd wait to see what the front looked like too. Unfortunately, my eyes never got past. <laughs> Second and third time. <laughs> I'm only kidding, sweetheart. I didn't want to marry you for your boots. <laughs> I think you're beautiful and you're kind and gentle yet willful. And I thank you for choosing me to spend the rest of your life with. We have been through more together over these last three years than some couples possibly never go through in a lifetime. And I believe that's made us stronger. We've both been able to communicate with each other and help pull each other through the tough times. And love and enjoy every minute of the good times. We're both very alike and yet still enough difference to keep each other on our toes and I love you for it. So can you all stand again please while we toast the bride. <laughs> and also get along with each other. We're now what we've called, what people would call a blended family. Hey everyone, uh, I'm sure most of you in here know who I am tonight. Uh, for those who don't, I'm Carl, Gavin's brother. Uh, as Gavin mentioned in his speech, how beautiful Warren looks and how beautiful bridesmaids look tonight, Bella and Robin. <laughs> smashed the front window in one shot. Not only he smashed the front window, he smashed two other windows with the same shot. Now that's not a skill. Class. <laughs> that's what I call skill. John Burgos trick shots. Gary's always thought of himself to be a bit of a sportsman. He plays cricket, table tennis, golf, uh, he even plays football. He told me once that he's good in every position. According to Lauren, he's not. <laughs> I am out of Matthew. I'm going to say Gavin and myself for being brothers and having that brother rival really used to do a bit of fighting. Mainly toy fighting, but. We did a bit of boxing and we went out on the front. We thought we'd do a bit of boxing on the front, didn't we? Well, there's like a grass garden and there's a concrete drive. So we boxed on the concrete drive. <laughs> um, that ended up with me waking up to Gavin slapping me saying, I promise you I'm out of if you don't tell Dad. <laughs> Between us brothers, being my older brother, always looked, 
always looked up to him, wanting to follow his footsteps. There were great laughs, great fights. There was none of that Gavin will be the guy who he is today. I'm very proud to say he's my brother. He's been there if he's ever needed to. And he's always helped others if he's always asked. And today I'm very honoured to be his best man.
the years you have to cherish together, the last the memories of the last forever. Capture all the special moments and hold them in your heart. Today you will vow to each other and make a perfect start. Today you begin the rest of your lives, together forever as husband and wife. Your dreams have come true with love and more, a happiness to share and a world to explore. Let the wind blow, let the rain fall. All of you together should sound proud and tall. Now the speech has come to an end. You are my brother for all your right friends. Decide which side she's going on. We're going to give him a big countdown. You just started doing it. Right, after, <laughs> after three, two, one, go on. Fantastic. Go all the way down. You can't that bit. Now, you're going to hold that pause while you're all...
happy wedding, people. Happy wedding day, sorry, I've been told by the wife. She said happy wedding day. Stop.